Hello guys, Matt here and welcome to the first episode of League of Legends Champions in Minecraft in which I recreate some champions abilities in Minecraft. This time we'll be taking a look at Vayne, the Night Hunter. Vayne is a ranged champion. Her passive is called Night Hunter and it makes Vayne move faster when she's faced towards an enemy champion. In Minecraft you need to press those two buttons to become Vayne. Now you can see that I get a movement boost while I'm looking at my enemy. Next we've got Vayne's first active ability, which is Humble. It makes Vayne dash a short distance and her has her next ability deal more damage. In Minecraft you need to press 2 to select the first ability and then press 1 to select your bow. The bow gains a power 1 enchantment that can get replaced by a regular bow after shooting one arrow and you get a huge speed boost for a fraction of a second. Vayne's W is Silver ball, Bolts, that makes her deal bonus true damage each three attacks on the same target. In Minecraft, each attack on the same target applies one stack that can be visible by black dots around the target. Second stack also adds a dot above the marked player. If you miss the target or hit another one, the stacks are removed. Upon reaching 3 stacks, the target is dealt 3 hearts of damage that cannot be reduced by any armor. An important thing you might want to keep in mind is that you cannot put stacks on any mobs. It only works for players and that is to prevent any bugs from occurring. Vein's E is called Condemn. The enemy targeted by this ability gets pushed back. If it hits the wall, it gets stunned for a short period of time. In the current version of Minecraft there seem to be some issues with punch enchantment used on other players, so I will show it on a zombie. To active the ability you need to press 4 and then 1 to choose the bow and your next basic attack. As you can see, the zombie gets pushed back. However, as I found it nearly impossible to do it, it does not stun the target upon hitting a wall. Vayne's last ability, her ultimate, is called Final Hour. That increases her attack damage, triples the passive speed bonus and makes her tumble ability give her invisibility for a short time. In Minecraft, Vayne's ultimate does exactly the same with the exception of her passive that in Minecraft seems a little bit too overpowered, so I decided to skip it. You get a power 1 bow that gets replaced by power 2 wha 1 when using tumble. You can freely combine all of her abilities. Using tumble will not exclude condom or final hour. So let's take a look at what is happening here. As you can see, there's a bunch com of command locks here that are constantly being powered by a fast clock. This row here checks with which direction Vayne is looking in and giving her a movement boost if there's a player in front of her. The second row is operating off on all of the other abilities as well as detecting which item slot is being chosen. Here we can see the reset button that has to be pressed each time a new player has joined the server. If you don't press it, some of the abilities may not work. You can also press it to reset the map, clearing all players' inventories and taking rows away from them. As you can see, here's a repeater facing even further and it is there for another champions that are yet to be done. What will they be? I don't know. Darius? Nivia. Something else? Please tell me in the comments. Leave a like if you enjoyed watching, subscribe to my channel and let me know that I'm not doing it all in vain.